All right. Hello again, Wednesday. It is hello again, Wednesday, number 19. And so I just want to welcome everyone to just kind of checking this out, uh, 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 hooking up with me every Wednesday. And I'm so glad that you are. This is uh, hello again, Wednesday. Um, I'm going to talk about that song in just a little bit. Uh, good old gospel ship. A lot of people have done good old gospel ship from Imperials, uh, Gaithers. Uh, that was Mylon Lefevre and Broken Heart. Um, saw them live in concert doing that show. And um, I also saw that uh, Paul Simon from Simon and Garfunkel also did good old gospel ship. And so, uh, yeah, a lot of people were doing uh, good old gospel ship. I'm going to talk about that trip thing in just a minute. Um, today, uh, Started off kind of funny. Uh, the grandkids reminded me very quickly that today was the day of green, as in St. Patrick's Day. And for me, whoops, I actually started off my day in blue. And they quickly reminded me that I was supposed to be in green, as in I don't think it was pinching. I think it was more of hitting. And so that would be Elijah giving me a good whack until I, even when I had a green shirt on, he was still doing it. Reminding me it's happy St. Patrick's Day for some people with the green. A lot of green at our house. Check out Lauren on her Facebook page. She's doing green also. And so it's kind of kind of some funny things that are taking place. Um, actually, um, when I was changing to a green shirt, I pulled this one shirt out of the closet. It's about 17 years old. I put it on and when I went like it ripped right across the shoulder which now kind of funny to me, a 17 year old green shirt. I reminded myself of Lou Ferrigno in the late seventies, very early eighties uh, with the Hulk. Okay. And the shirt rips. Um, that's only in my own head that I'm buff like Lou Ferrigno in uh, the Hulk. But otherwise it was just a, a fun start to the day. And so I come off with this. What's so funny? In my own head, like I said, it is easy for me to laugh at my own jokes, my own little quips, whereas others like Connie and them uh, might go, eh, you know, not so funny. You know who, who will laugh pretty much at a lot of my stuff? Kinda is Lauren. I can really get Lauren to start laughing at my stuff. And so uh, I think I'm funny. Um, in fact, to tell the truth, I'm going to put a, a picture in the comments. Because as I started off my day, there were some pictures that were flying around. Um, a friend of mine posted this really cool Snoopy picture. If you go to um, some earlier Facebook posts that I have today, um, you'll see that picture of Snoopy talking about how awesome uh, uh, the day is or something like that. I have already forgotten it. It did remind me, this isn't funny, but it reminded me of a t-shirt that I wear often. And it's so awesome, it hurts. It's a Snoopy shirt posted uh, both of those pictures to start my day. But then as I'm looking at some things uh, uh, throughout the, the morning, there was a funny picture and I'm posting that in the comments. It is of Moses. And if you know the story of Moses leading the uh, God's children out of Egypt, they were enslaved for so many years and Moses comes, let my people go. And so he leads them out. And this picture is a picture of Moses in his 40th year in the desert and it's zi the uh, people follow him in one line and they're zigzagging behind Moses and they're yelling recalculating 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 Moses says something like knock it off or something like that just a funny picture to me it was even funnier in my head because it just reminded me of trips or vacations trips or vacations with dad or trips or vacations with papa as the grandkids would call me is never a trip without a u-turn or without what we call a ue you know so if papa if papa is doing a u-turn or if dad's doing a u-turn or a ue it's a trip we're messed up we're not lost we're just missed a turn and we're making the ue recalculating is what the GPS would say. And so God bless the GPS. In fact, um, if I uh, really was to go back, my dad uh, in Illinois, Tom Tom Miller, Thomas Miller, uh, you can look him up too. Uh, he bought many years ago a Tom Tom. You remember the Garmin's or this was a Tom Tom. And so we laughed. I mean, it was funny in my head and maybe in his head too, because a Tom Tom. Tom bought 
a Tom Tom that was supposed to give him guidance and directions. Um, one of the first maps that you could have. It was a piece that you bought. Now you got him on your phone. This piece he bought for his uh, truck. And I can remember taking a trip to Arizona and at, on this one particular trip, he had his brand new Tom Tom. We were gonna go to the North Rim. We, we do like the Grand Canyon. I got some friends out there in Arizona that are huge Grand Canyon fans. Um, in fact, uh, a friend of mine from uh, Pekin just went to the Grand Canyon. Uh, and so on this trip to the North Rim, usually we do the South Rim. On this trip to the North Rim, we took the Tom Tom. And the funny thing was, as we are heading back from the, the North Rim site, so now we're heading back to uh, head over to Flagstaff, where uh, my sister Carrie lives. And we're heading back. And that's Tom Tom kept wanting us to take these dirt roads that turn right, turn right, turn right. And we knew those dirt roads led to the rim of the canyon and you would just go off the rim. How stupid is that? We would never ever follow everything a Tom Tom says or sometimes your GPS is just messed up, let's be honest. And so, but we laugh about it even today we laugh about that Tom Tom wanting to take us to the to the rim again. Uh, last week I asked you, hey, what was your favorite song? I went through that little bit. So this week I started off with Good Old Gospel Ship, um, not to do another song, but um, actually I, I I don't even know why I picked that song. Um, oh, I know because to me the trip was funny. Taking trips to the Grand Canyon, that was that was funny, you know, going to the to the rim. So, what's so funny? Boy, I lost it for a sec there, didn't I? Keep it clean, but tell me what's one of the funny things that's ha happened in your uh, experiences on vacations, or if you have a funny joke or a funny picture. Like I said, keep it clean, but what is so funny? And in your head, it might be funny, and that's okay. Hey, you know what? Uh, a lot of things are happening now where uh, uh, some restrictions are are uh, being lifted and stuff. So um, check out a church near you. You never know. Maybe your Bible study is now in person. I know ours is in about four hours. And so uh, we have ours at four o'clock Pacific time out here. And we even Zoom it. If you'd like to join us on our Bible study Zoom link, uh, let me know. And I will get that link right out to you. But check out a church near you. And um, as I, in saying that, always be safe. And I'll see you again next Wednesday. Hello again Wednesday, everyone.